there are eight persons a b c d e f g and h who are planning to take a leave in the month of march june august and november in each month they will take a leave on 6th or 11th of the given month only one person will take a leave on these given dates e will take a leave in the month which has less than 31 days three persons will take a leave between e and c two persons will take a leave between c and g three persons will take a leave between g and d two persons will take a leave between d and a three persons will take a leave between a and f two persons will take a leave between f and b h will not take leave in the november month so basically if you observe there is no clue or no hint given here about which person has taken a leave in which month and on which date all they have talked about here is the gap between different pairs of persons three persons between e and c two persons between c and g three persons between g and d and so on okay now we have to find out how these persons have taken the leaves right eight persons total a to h four months march june august and november and two dates per month sixth and eleventh so four months into two dates per month will make it eight dates right so what can be done here uh see one way to try it out is to maybe you know draw this block so very quickly i mean you can quickly fill the gaps and finish it off right like for example let's say it's like a rectangular box these are the months march june august and november the dates are 6th and 11th remember which is the first position here one then this is two three four five six seven eight you understand this is the order you have to follow you have to go in this direction when you are filling up the table here uh, the the cells here right 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 you cannot say 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 because the sequence is march 6th then march 11th june 6th then june 11th april oh, sorry august 6th august 11th november 6th november 11th and so on okay now within this we can get multiple possibilities uh that that depends on what kind of clues are given to us like for example if you read the first statement it says uh, only one person will take a leave on each of these given dates e will take a leave in the month which has less than 31 days e will take a leave in a month which has less than 31 days now march has 31 days august has 31 days june has got 30 days and november has got 30 days you get him a point this is a 31 day month this is a 30 day month is a 31 day month and november is a 30 day month so e will take a leave in the month which has less than 31 days he will take a leave in the month which has less than 31 days so e will take a leave either in june or in november he cannot take leave in march or august right now there are four possibilities basically one two three four possibilities for e so should we start with all the four maybe yes or see if you can have a clue which can help you cut down some of them like e will take a leave in the month which has less than 31 days three persons will take a leave between e and c three persons will take a leave between e and c mm. yeah so i think we, we will have multiple possibilities i mean if you take e let's say on june 6th c will come one two three c comes in number 30 if you take e on june 11 where will c come november uh, 11 right if e takes leave on june 6 there are three persons three persons between e and c so if e is june 6 1 2 3 c comes on november 6 if e is june 11 1 2 3 c comes on november 11 and the opposite also can be done like if e takes leave on november 6 1 2 3 c will come on june 6 if e takes leave on november 30 c will come on now, number 11 june will uh, sorry c will come on number uh, june 11 okay so so this is one way of doing it maybe you can take four possibilities you can draw four such uh, boxes rectangular grids and fill the gaps or otherwise you can also consider a straight arrangement i'll i'll explain you the other approach as well right what is the straight way 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 persons right these are the eight positions 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 put down the dates in this fashion instead of doing a rectangular grid you can put down the dates like this this is march uh, 6 march 11 then june 6 june 11 uh, august 6 august 11 and november 6 november 11 here also you can draw four straight lines i mean four cases if four cases are actually available and then fill up the gaps 
रिमेंबर मार्च आर थर्टी वन डेज मंथ दीज टू आर थर्टी वन डेज मंथ आई मीन दीज टू आर थर्टी वन डेज दीज टू आर थर्टी डेज दीज टू आर अगेन थर्टी वन डेज ऑगस्ट एंड नवंबर इज थर्टी डेज Now the very first statement, right? It says E will take a leave in the month which has less than thirty-one days. It can be E on June sixth or June eleven or November sixth or November eleven. Yeah. So there are two ways of solving such questions: either do rectangular grids like this, or do straight linear arrangements like this. Remember, when you are doing rectangular grids, you have to be careful. If you take E here, and he says there is a gap of three persons between, let's say, E and uh, C, you cannot say one, two, three, and C comes here. You cannot. Go in this direction. You have to go vertically like this, right? One, two, three. C has to come here. In case you are going by uh, rectangular arrangements, right? Rectangular grids. But anyway, it looks like the demand is for uh, linear arrangement, a straight kind of arrangement. So let's try that. So what we can do is maybe take all the four possibilities. So it's not very complex. Uh, it will be very easy. Or what you can do is maybe read out all the points and see if there is anything concrete given to you. Like for example. I I don't see anything else which can help us. Three persons between E and C, two persons between C and G, three persons between G and D, two persons between A D and A, three persons between A and F, two between F and B. H will not take a leave in the month of November. Remember, H cannot come in these two months. H does not come in these two. So you have to keep that in mind. So let's quickly start filling up. Right? I have taken four cases because there are four possible positions of E, and accordingly we'll have to fill the gaps. So. The first clue: E will take a leave in a month which has less than thirty-one days. So E can take on June six, or E can take on June eleven, or E can take on November six, or E can take on November eleven. Four possible positions of E. Now read the next statement: Three persons will take a leave between E and C. Three persons between E and C. So E dash 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 C. E here dash 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 C not possible. Dash 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 C. Similarly, in this case, one two three C. E here one two three C, three persons between E and C. So accordingly, we have the positions of C. Two persons will take a leave between C and G. Two persons between C and G. So C is here, right? One two G comes here because G cannot go on that side. Similarly, C is here, right? One two G comes here. You cannot take G on the right hand side of C. Similarly, two persons will take a leave between C and G. C dash dash G. Now in this case, we have got two possibilities of G again. He says two persons will take a leave between C and G. C Dash dash g is possible, or dash dash g is also possible. So I think immediately let's duplicate this case, and take case number five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. E is fixed, c is fixed, g comes here, or g comes here. Remember, do not go by the length of the explanation or uh, the amount of time that I am spending here. It will take far lesser time for you because you will not be explaining it to anyone, right? And you will quickly start with these four possibilities. So two persons will take a leave between C and G. That is done. Three persons will take a leave between G and D. Three persons between G and D. So G, one, two, three, not possible. One, two, three, D comes here. Between G and D, there should be three persons. So one, two, three, D. G again here. One, two, three, D comes here. Right? Then G is here. One, two, three, D comes here. G is here. One, two, three, D comes here. One, two, three, D comes here. It's very easy to fill the gaps. Two persons will take a leave between D and A. Two between D and A. So D dash dash A. D dash dash A. Now here comes the problem. You see, we know that two persons will take a leave between D and A. D dash dash A. A and E are overlapping. Possible? Not possible. Hence, case number two is wrong. Forget about case number two. Now try case number three. Two persons between D and A. D dash dash A. D dash dash A not possible this side dash dash A has to come here. Similarly, in the last case D dash dash A is not possible this side so D dash dash A comes here. Okay, three persons will uh, take a leave between A and F. So with respect to A now fix F. Three persons between A and F. A dash 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 F. That's the only possibility. Second case you forget now it's ruled out. Then A dash 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 F comes here. A is here. Dash 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 F. Three persons between A and F. Similarly, A is here. Dash 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 F comes here. Next point. Two persons will take a leave between F and B. Two persons will take a leave between F and B. Two between F and B. So F dash dash B overlapping with G, right? So case one is also wrong. Ruled out. Two persons between F and B. 
dash dash b f is here dash dash b f is here dash dash b done so i think case 1 and 2 are ruled out 3 4 and 5 looks possible who's left out only h is left out i guess h can be fixed here here or here in this case or here in this case now read the last point h will not take leave in the month of november here in case number 3 you find that h is in november so case 3 is wrong yes or no last two positions are for november in case number 4 also h is on november you see h is going for november november 6th so case 4 is also wrong case 5 is correct the same thing can be done using rectangular grids also like i have explained case 5 is the final answer so this is march 6 march 11 june 6 june 11 august 6 august 11 november 6 november 11 case 5 is the final solution